he howled. The call to retreat. A fighting retreat. It took longer than you can imagine for the World Eaters to realize the battle was over. I heard whole companies still trying to fight the wolves as Russ's legion ran for their gunships. <laughs> they took a lot of trophies for their tallies. Many still wear them. You didn't answer Russ's question. Did you truly learn nothing from that fight? What revelation should I have come to? I learned he wasn't allowed to kill me. I learned he postured in the hope of bringing me back to terror, collared, and submissive to his whims. No. No, 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 Angron, you stubborn fool. None of that matters. There were more dead wolves on that field than world eaters. That matters. Russ had you cold. You said you had him at your mercy, but he crawled free. He crawled? <laughs> and when he rose, he had you surrounded. He could have killed you. He tried and failed. His men, Angron. His legion could have killed you. Whether the Emperor ordered it or not, Russ spared your life. He didn't retreat in shame, you arrogant. He was probably lamenting your thick skull all the way back to terror, hoping you'd heed a rather consummate lesson in brotherhood and loyalty. Look what happened. Yes, you beat him in a duel. Yes, your men took down more of his than his of yours. And yet, who won the battle? The World Eaters. I appreciate that every living being must, by the nature of perception, understand and process life in a different way. But even for you, brother, this is achingly obtuse. You're saying the wolves won? How can you not see it? They won. A victory worthy of engraving on their armor for all time. While you were glorying in your strength, Russ's sons were loyal enough to come to him, to surround you both, to threaten your life while you stood at the vanguard of your own legion. That may be the most comprehensive moment of all outmaneuvering in the history of the Legion's Astartes. It's almost poetic in its elegance and emotional resonance. He proves his son's loyalties while yours leave you to die. He proves the damage the nails are doing to your legion. He proves the tactical strength of taking an objective rather than fighting purely to kill. He spares your life in the hope you'll see all of this is a lesson it cost him heavily to teach you. And your reaction is to grin and claim yourself the victor. Only one of us ran away that night. He's weak. God's blood. The Primarchs are the bridge between the Emperor and the species he leads. We are all weak, for we are all equal. All of us. We are humanity magnified, its virtues and its flaws. I am not weak. I have never been weak. You are not only weak if you fail to understand Russ's lesson. You are also a fool.